Warsaw architect for Vitek Gabrisch. Let there be modernism, he says, and in the radiant flat world arising on his square of Bristol, a cube shimmers, then balconies appear, and freshly waxed floors, and kitchens still innocent of grease and smoke. Will he add some tall cones of cedar or a brush tip of poplar? Anything is possible beneath a thin wash sky. His own apartment is a wreck of central planning, low ceilings, cracked tile, the orange linoleum of some 70s utopia. Exposed wires dangle in the hall, the lift reeks of garbage. A Freudian billboard obscures the house number with praise for a cigarette, both strong and hard. How does he move between these realms? What passport of intellect or spirit allows him to forsake parabola and grid for this corridor weeping with onions? On his screen, Warsaw appears flat as paper, a page erased by fire before granite dreams of coal miners holding up the world. Outside, a cold rain, chimneys and pavement, the color of tea, women hauling in stockings from the balconies. I love the hand's provisional flourish before the first line, when anything can emerge, even this Austrian market with suburban shoppers, even this high-rise of breakfast flakes, this Danube of soda.